All right, guys, it's Dabixi here, here with another Kaldheim opening. Today we're doing the Kaldheim set boosters. Excited for this. I know you're able to get some pretty decent pulls out of it. I also really like the art cards. I know when uh, they did this for Zendikar Rising, I uh, ended up collecting all of the art cards. So, just because I liked them. All right, this is a... 30, 30 uh, pack unboxing, but the thing is, is uh, each pack has 12 cards in it, so a bit less, less than what we're used to with normal packs. As much fun as opening the collector boosters are, I really wish they'd just get rid of them, honestly. Oh, wow, a gold stamped card, or a gold signed card already, nice. Like, I really, really wish um, they just have draft and set boosters. I think that's all that's needed. Okay. So an old growth troll. Nice, full, not, nice rare hit. And a foil common in the back. Yeah, I think if, like, they just took out collector boxes... Magic, in general, would be in such a better state, at least from the financial perspective. I don't... I can't fix the cards they print, but... Man. The art in this set's just awesome. But, yeah, I think if they got rid of the collector's boxes, I really think it'd fix the financial side of Magic the Gathering. Ooh, Magda. Other... And a foil, Svela, the Ice Shaper, and a Fortel Counter. Did we only get one rare last pack? I thought we got... And I just missed it? No. Oh, yep, just one. Okay. Sorry. I'm so used to going slow. Nice art card. Because I just did the collector box opening. That I'm not going as fast as I usually do. Pick it up. Ooh, Bergy, God of Storytelling. Foil Uncommon in the back, and a treasure token. <clears throat> anyway, how are you guys feeling about the set so far? I know a lot, a lot of people are playing around with it in standard, so it's, we're sort of figuring out how to do things in it now, I think. Something like that. Or, like, in the sense that, like, um, Rise the Dreadmorn. Ooh. A uh, Freilis Lanawar Fury. Nice. List Mythic. Um, like, I know people are just, like, learning or tr figuring out, like, what the meta is for the set. So, I'm not sure where things are at right now. I've seen a few things. I've seen, like, Giants. Is it Giants have been doing all right, I guess. And, uh... What else? Man, isn't there like a percentage chance of getting like a certain amount of, uh, oh, another old growth troll, a certain amount of, um, commons, foil rare, a certain amount of commons compared to uncommons? Like I know in like the first few slots, you're able to get, um, like one common and like a bunch of uncommons possibly if you're really lucky. There's our foil Rhymewood Falls, or Foil Land, nice. Yeah, see, like, that one had two uncommons. And a bunch of, or sorry, two commons and a bunch of uncommons. Carter, Doom Scourge, and a Foil Common in the back. Yeah, that one had four commons. We're not really getting any packs that are uh, having multiple rares in it. Ooh, a list card, nice. Belfy Spirit. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll keep track of the list cards in one pile and the mythics in the other. So. Ooh. That's the alternate art for the uh, Serpent Commander. 
It's really cool. So that time had six commons. Ooh, and a mythic. Nice. Alron's Epiphany. Another common foil. Yeah, I know like you're technically able to get like up to four rares in a single pack. So that'd be really insane if we hit that. But like that's like hitting the lottery with these. Or like a mini lottery. Another fella. And a common foil in the back. Yeah, I feel like we're not getting many uh many packs. What is that? Not sure if you guys are able to see that, but there's like a print liner, some sort of marking on it. The art on it's really sick. Don't know what cards that's from. Five commons. Cosima. Yeah, I feel like we haven't really gotten any packs with multiple rares aside from the one foil rare pack. And I know you're able to like get up to three, sometimes up to four if you get like a foil rare in the back. And then like, uh, what is it? But like, you're supposed to get more than one per pack, I think on average, Cyclone Summoner. But, you know, we beat the averages all the time on this channel in the worst way. There's a list card in the back here. Ooh, two commons that time. Nice. Blessing of Frost. Narfi Betrayer King. And a foil common. And our list card is an Enclave Cryptologist. One of those level up cards. It's pretty cool. Another foil land. Weathered Runestone. Icebreaker Kraken. Jorn, God of Winter. And a foil rare in the back. Nice. Crippling Fear. Man, I still haven't hit a gold span dragon. That's like all I want to hit in one of these unboxings. I also haven't hit a foreign clux, so we're trying for both of them. There's a Quake Bringer. I think I've hit one of those. Ooh, Maskwood Nexus, a Certland Elementalist, and a Foil Common. Nice. So that was a th that was a three rare, rare pack. I can't talk. Three rare rare. Why is that so hard to say? Three rare pack. So that's pretty good. Man, that art is so cool. Runeforge Champion, Common, and a Foil Common in the back. Vorinclex art. It's not the Vorinclex we're looking for, but the art nonetheless. <laughs> King Narfi. Ooh, a Bright Step Pathway. Nice. Common and a foil common in the back. All right, we're about halfway through the opening at this point. I think we're doing all right. I think, not sure. I'm not sure what the averages are for this product. Foil, or sorry, rare. Common and a foil uncommon. I really like Sagas as a concept, but I know overall in Commander they're not too well. Don't do too well, at least. But I think for Standard, they tend to, I think they're a, a good thing. A good inclusion. Doom Scar. I think this is like... 
the first time I've hit a Doom Scar in like this, like all of the openings I've done so far. Foil common in the back. So that's a bit odd, but you know, whatever. Okay, so we got a list card on this one. Oh man, that alternate art Vorinclex. So cool. Uncommon, uncommon, Sarulf, Realm Eater, a replicating ring, nice, a foil common, and a Vodolian Illusionist, interesting. Alright, we're about we're two thirds of the way through now. Another foil land. Cosmos Charger, Ferja, Judge of Valor, and a Masked Vandal for another common foil. Foil, another foil land, nice. I forget what the percentages are for the foil lands, but Crippling Fear, ooh, another mythic, all run God of the Cosmos. And Haka Whispering Raven in the back. A common and a foil common. Elvish Warmaster. Ooh, Cleaving Reaper. I think this is one of the ones that you can only get in a set booster and the, uh, what is it? The different kind. The theme boosters? Yeah. I think that's one of the rares you can only get in a theme boost booster. And a set booster. So that's cool that you're able to get them in this at least. And they aren't forcing you to buy theme boosters. Tyrite Sanctum. Bark, Bark Channel Pathway. Tide Channel Pathway in the back. Finn the Fang Bear. An old growth troll for a foil rare. Oh, and we got a list card. Calming Lissid. Nice. Oh, what the heck? Mystic Reflection. Bears of Jara. Frost Auger and a Foil Common. Ooh, a full art Quakebringer for the duplicate mythic, which is a bit rough, but full art Quakebringer nonetheless, which is pretty cool. Like to see it. How many packs do we have left? Four packs, five packs left after this, including this one. Ooh, another another mythic. I have a few of these now. Star Starnheim Unleashed. Got a bunch of them. Inga, Rune Eyes, and an Ice Hide Troll. Ooh, Prismatic Geoscope for the list card in the back. It's actually a pretty decent card in a five-color deck. Another foil land. Nico defies destiny. Rare and a village rights for the foil common. <clears throat> Three packs left. Blood on the snow for the rare. Ice bind pillar. And a Narfi Betrayer King for the foil com uncommon in the back. Alright. A 
a Battle of the Frost and Fire, Shimmer Veil, and a Foil Common. All right, last pack. Hopefully some juice in the end. There's a list card, nice. Battle of Bredegard, Morite, Moretti, Moretti, and a Victimize in the back. All right. Well, that's an overall decent box opening, I think. Anyway, thanks for checking out the video. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, comment. See you guys next time.